Hello everyone. Today we will present how Skydive can help in managing the deployment of configuration changes across your Kubernetes landscape. For the purpose of this demonstration, we are going to use the sample WordPress application. Let's view the application topology within Skydive. To limit the scope, we are only showing objects which have their app equals WordPress. Let's now express this as a Gremlin expression in the filter box. And when running the expression, we get a two-tier landscape. WordPress, the main application. WordPress MySQL, the database. Let's explore the configuration object of the WordPress app. Using the highlight functionality, we select Kubernetes config, resulting in the highlighting of the MySQL pass object. Let's now focus on the MySQL pass object. To do so, we construct a Gremlin expression in the highlight box. We run the expression and as expected, the MySQL pass is highlighted. We click the object and explore the metadata. We can see the password field, Kubernetes data password. And if we want to highlight which pods are dependent on MySQL pass, we can extend our Gremlin query. We add an extra Gremlin step which requests nodes which have an edge leading into MySQL pass. We execute the query and now we see that two pods are using this password. WordPress, WordPress MySQL. Let's view the actual password as seen within each pod. We use a script which accesses a pod and prints the password from an environment variable. We run tests Kubernetes WordPress secret get. From the output, we can see that the password is ABC123. Updating passwords is a best practice which should happen routinely. Let's update our password from ABC123 to ABC456 by replacing the secret objects as follows. Now, let's view the running pods again. WordPress pod is still running the old password. WordPress MySQL is also still using the old password. So while the secret object was updated, the pods are still using the old ABC123 password. In fact, so as to update the pod passwords, we need to recreate the pods or delete the pods and let the deployment object recreate them. We can use Skydive to identify which pods depend on the MySQL pass secret object and then delete them manually. Alternatively, we can automate by utilizing Skydive REST API. The following script does just that, extracts a list of pods which depend on MySQL pass and deletes them. Now back to the Skydive UI, we see that both pods that were the consumers of the password have automatically been reset. As a result, we now see the old pods in white and the new pods in red. Eventually, the old pods will disappear. New pods will stabilize and will become white, indicating they are up and running. Now, let's verify that the password in both pods is updated. We run tests Kubernetes WordPress secret get. The password is ABC456 as expected. In this demo, we showed how Skydive can help visualize the relation between pods and configuration objects. We showed how this topological information maintained by Skydive can be utilized to construct automation helping to keep the landscape updated. For more information, please refer to the links below. Thank you for watching.